Hello everyone, welcome back to part 6 of my Resident Evil 3 remake playthrough. In the last episode, Jill fought an animal-like nemesis, uh, and at the end of that battle, she was stabbed by a weird projectile from a tentacle. We're not going to go into too much detail there, uh, but she is now infected. Uh, luckily, Carlos did find her and drug her ass to the hospital. Uh, when now we're trying to find a cure. Uh, we got the key card, which should give us some access to more areas of the hospital. And the hunter has made an appearance. It's actually outside the door right now, so let's get into it. Alright, hopefully it's not just standing right there. Alright. Apparently missing something in the staff room. But we're not gonna we're not gonna push our luck. This is outside, you know. We'll make our way over here. So we can crawl through that or it can crawl through. Alright, this is reception, alright. We're still good. The hunter has not found us yet. We're gonna Wipe our new key card. Oh, I forgot to store the key. Oh no. There's two in there. Don't see me, don't see me, don't see me. That's not good. Looks like they're just wailing on some bodies in there. No! Get out. We need to be quiet. We can't let them hear us. Jennifer. Stay down. We're trying to be quiet. That's a locked door, but there's more salt right there. <laughs> oh, guys. Check it out. Toilet paper. Jackpot. Uh, Carlos. Uh, Tyrell, this is Carlos. Uh, we're ready for evac. We have found the toilet. Oh, fuck! Damn it! Why, doctor? We were doing a bit, doctor. We talked about this. No. Fuck. Well. That's what we get for screwing around. The resonating. I can't open this. Oh. oh. Alright, that takes me back to the window. I don't want to do this. I knew I shouldn't do that. Oh no! Damn it! I want it on that side. Well, I screwed up on that one. Or did I? Maybe I did. No. Can I get into the operating room? Maybe this works out. Oh no, it doesn't work out. Never mind. Ignore me, I'm just wasting time. What? Well, I can open up this now. To be fair, these zombies are exponentially increasing. There was one, now there's three. Thanks for the herb, Doctor. It doesn't seem very sanitary in an operating room, but... You need to do these handgun bullets. Or the 60 rounds of assault mining rifle weapon. Then... There's reports of lost items, and it's unclear. Nurse station safe. The safe combination is... 9... Clock... Three counter. 
<laughs> Why is there should be three? What is going on? What are they loading these poor bodies up with grenades and shit? This seems like poor medical practice. I'm waiting for y'all to come through there. Alright, doctor, we lost the patient. Oh, that's fun. Load him up with grenades. What about this one? Oh, he gets flashbangs. There's three hunters on the loose. I'm not looking forward to this. This will give me a second to play with this. Oh, cancel. Nine clockwise. Three counterclockwise. Oh! A two key, a two number thing. That's cool. We're gonna combine that. Yeah. Pipping out our assault rifle over here. Alright. Y'all still in there? Literally waiting at the door. Come on, hunt. Oh, that's just a TV. I thought it was something hanging from the ceiling. Uh, why does it sound like it's above me? Oh, oh, it's coming. Come on. Oh. <laughs> it's just a regular... <laughs> it was just a regular zombie. That's not. Can y'all not open doors? <laughs> Just hitting it with the door. Fuck, oh, Carlos. Did I get it? Oh, it's not dead. Oh, I thought that would do it. Come on. Yes! We got it! They take a hundred rounds! So not exactly worth it. Cock, you're ugly. Say hello to my little friend! Yeah. Is there any reason to waste that many bullets? <clears throat> 30 more bullets. Aha! Yes. Oh no. We're gonna have to drop something. Yeah, goodbye card. That audio cassette is way more important. Alright, so definitely a good thing we came in the room. And we don't want that one. We want this one. Oh my god, Carlos! <laughs> All this stuff we're finding this for this assault rifle. We got a grip. How do we get over here? Make it looks nothing else over here. Make it over.
Well, there's got to be a way over there. We need our tape recorder back. Yeah. Make sure we're not missing everything. There's something in the staff room in this linen room right here. Should only be one more one more hunter running around. Not this way. No. We got everything out of here, right? <clears throat> yeah. And then at the end of the hall is the living room. Which has the other lock cabinet. Yes. Cool. We're gonna make our way downstairs. The fast way. Because apparently Carlos is a live action hero. Hang on, left, right. No. Oh my god, see, I, ca I called it. They were multiplying. There was a couple, there was one, then there were a couple, now there's like four. Just a, just a stabby party. Take handgun ammo and another lock box. So I must get access to Jill here in a minute. Use. <clears throat> All I wanted to know was what the documents were doing in your office in the first place. Who do you think you're talking to? I'm goddamn Nathaniel Bard. I'm the best biologist you'll ever meet, you bet pen changing waste <laughs> of a nursing degree. Of course I have connections higher up. Of course the military can... Dude is a piece of shit. Don't treat anybody you work with like that. Come on, dude. I almost hope that nurse fed you to do something. Bard. <clears throat> Tyrell. <coughs> Bard's dead. He's been shot. Shit. And the vaccine? I'm looking. Well, look harder. There's gotta be a computer, right? He's sitting here through the open window. They shot in the forehead. But if he was facing this way, there's no way that angle would have been possible. It is my pleasure to cordially invite you to the banquet on September 10th. Unless he turned around and they shot him in the head. Which would make sense, I guess, because the way his chair is facing. Umbrella computer! Greg, I know you're watching the news. The virus is going to devour the whole county. Country. The dead will wash over Capitol Hill like a tidal wave. I have in my position one dose of vaccine for the virus. The Holy Grail. This is VRC Chief Nathaniel Bard, September 29, 11 p.m. I am acutely aware that my time's running out. And I hope and pray 
by making this recording and bringing the truth to light, that I can restore some small shred of honor to my name. All of Raccoon City's suffering began with the release of a biological weapon known as the T-Virus. My employer, the Umbrella Corporation, engineered this virus. Mm -hmm. And they ordered my team to develop a vaccine, which we did. Now, I keep samples of this vaccine here in my office. The rest of it is stored underground. But those sons of bitches at the board, they want to destroy it. They don't want the world to know what they've done. So they're trying to erase all evidence that the virus ever existed. Doing a great job of that. No, I'm not a fool. I know they don't want me to... <laughs> hmm. I got you, we won't walk. And she trusted me anyway. Yeah. Because it wouldn't have done her any good. <clears throat> That's right, Carlos. Punch the computer. Monitor. Oh. Is that how we open secure doors? It's just a good old fist through the screen. Is it here? Huh. Yes, it is. Yay. All right, Joe. Hang tight. T, I got it. Good. I'm headed your way. Be careful. Careful? <laughs> Have you seen this town? It'll be a fucking miracle if I get there in one piece. <laughs> he speaks the truth. Uh... Um, Jill... I forgot how to get to you. There's a box. Oh my god. What did we talk about? Boundaries. It was one time. Oh god. Reload. Another box. I wonder how to get to that box out there. It's gonna drive me insane until I get it. That's gonna lock on it too. We're gonna save Jill. Jill, 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 Jill. Jill, we stuck you in this room. You're gonna be okay, Jill. Use. We saved her. We're a hero. Where are you sticking that? Okay. Not the color of vaccine I won't put in my body, but hey, if it works. Come on. This shit better work. Did you keep it chilled? <laughs> Don't shoot me. Tyrell, what the hell happened? Attention all citizens. The contagion spreading throughout the city has been designated uncontainable. On October 1st, Raccoon City will be completely destroyed in a missile strike. All residents capable of rational thought are urged to evacuate immediately. Jesus. This is not a test. Attention all citizens. I mean, that's only a day away. There's still people in the city. You think Uncle Sam gives a shit? Fuck. Here they come. Oh, you sit tight. I got this. He's dig a bit. I like Terrell. Better grab some gear. <clears throat> Sounds like there's a lot of them out there. So you give me one can of first aid spray. Hmm. We are going to store that. Move that up there. What do we want for this? Let's, let's take a full stack of grenades, I guess. 
Do I have a red herb? Can I get a red herb? Yes. Three health items. Almost three stacks of it bullets. Three grenades. That should be enough, right? I sure hope so. Let's go save Jill's life. Again. I'm gonna try to lower the window shutters. The less entry points, the better. And how do we do that? I'll try hacking into the hospital security system. Keep them off me in the meantime. Well, good for him for barricading. Oh my god. Now the fun shit begins. Oh my goodness. That window still looks like it's shut. <sighs> Don't come in the door. Hey, Tyrell, I'm gonna need you to hurry up with those shutters. What do we got over here? Oh, a, a detonator. Stay away from that. So you would think, in this situation, the zombies would come for Carlos, being, you know, out in the open. Oh no. Oh, come on. Find the breaker. It must be somewhere. Must be somewhere? Oh no, oh no. Oh no, no, no. Oh, I'm getting sloppy. How are you doing, Carlos? Uh, uh, that's full. We use that. Which means... I can grab that. Okay. Oh my god. Where did you come from? Oh, hip pouch. Sure. Do I have room for anything else? No. They have not breached the room. Not what I want to do. I want to save that. Get down. Get down. 20 of the more shots. Let me go pick up that herb. Mm 
Oh no, oh no! Oh my god. Sit down. Whoa. One more bullet? I can do that. There we go. Probably. I was already back there. I mean, got a double up. Yeah. Now we just have to worry about the hunters coming through the big hole at the top. Yeah, buddy. Not even close. But at least it's over. Yeah. I'm coming back. <laughs> Where'd the big pile of stuff go? Vaccine's the real deal. Good. You going somewhere? You're damn right. What do you think you're gonna do? Whole city's about to be microwaved. Come on, man. Call the government. Tell them we found a cure. You stall for time. Bowsy motherfucker. <laughs> I like you, Terrell. He's a good guy. He cares. <gasps> You're okay. Oh, Terrell, where'd you go? You're supposed to stay. Wait, what? God, you okay? I've got good news. It's over now. The city's safe. Hmm? Carlos. <laughs> Don't shoot Tyrell. Reach <laughs> up. It's not. Hmm. Where am I? It's a hell of an intense dream. What's going on? Oh. Yeah, I bet you that hurts. You got stabbed with Nemesis. Attention all citizens. The missile strike on Raccoon City will occur in just hours. The payload is designed to eradicate all biological material. You hmm. will not survive if you remain in the city. October 1st. Evacuate now. Repeat. No. Evacuate now. Can't be. This is not a test. You lost, what, a day? Were you laying on the grenade launcher? So that can't be comfortable. No wonder your arm hurts. Alright. Well, we got control of Jill back. So we're going to go ahead and end the episode there. 
Thank y'all for hanging out for episode six of Resident Evil 3, the remake. Uh, if you like what you see, consider giving me a thumbs up. If there's anything I miss, leave a comment down below, and I will see y'all in the next one.